Hello, Vinyl Cats here. 2018 is the new year, and welcome to Stacked 45s. The return of a feature where I grab some of my 45s out of my storage archive and uh, pile them up on an old Monarch, a BSR Monarch U88 turntable, uh, dating from 19... 19- 57. As it happens, I can't find a way of getting more than about seven records stacked on here without them slipping. So we're going to do what we can. This is completely unrehearsed. If they slip, they slip. If they play, they play. Now, I've done a few of these videos before and some of them got taken off uh, because the copyright uh, thing picked up the music I was playing. So I'm going to have to play kind of very short bits and talk over them uh, to avoid the copyright thing, uh, which is all the rage on YouTube, as you know, it's kind of annoying, but, uh, you know, there's there's not really a particular way round that. Right, okay, stacked 45s, let's go and uh, see what happens, and these are all singles from the 1970s, uh, so we will uh, check it out and see what happens. And the first one on the turntable from Atlantic Records is I Can't Stand the Rain from Eruption. I'm going to talk continuously over it and hope that it's not detected as we do stacked 45s right here live on Vinyl Cats and completely and totally unrehearsed. As I said, if the record slip, then they slip. I can't help about that. Let's uh, carry on. And uh, see what happens to the next one, which is from 1977. And it's the Star Wars theme from Miko, which was a big hit on the RCA record label. And uh, so far, that seems to be playing OK. Uh, I'm going to ca- have to carry on talking. Uh, so, so again, no, oh, the copyright thing, it can be so annoying. But all I'm doing is try to illustrate how wonderful this old Monarch BSR UA8 turntable is. Except this one needs servicing because I can only get about seven records on it. Let's continue and see the next one drop down, which it is. And it's the Beach Boys on Capitol Records from 1970. And uh, the title is Cotton Fields. A uh, big hit in America and the UK as well. It's Playing without slipping, which is very good. Very, very good indeed. As you know, old 45s in the 60s, or 50s, 1960s, the 70s, and uh, kind of the early 1980s had inner grooves with raised sort of edges. So the records would lock together when they were on um, sort of auto changes from the 1950s, 60s, 70s and 80s. By sort of 1980s, of course, auto changers were on the way out. So 45s after about 1980, sort of 1981-ish, I think, didn't have that sort of locking groove in the middle so that records would not drop down and play on top of each other anymore because people just didn't do that. Anyway, let's continue. Bye-bye, Beach Boys. Next one. Oh, two drop down there. <laughs> we're on Island Records from 1977 again and uh, The Rods and uh, Do Anything You Want to Do uh, the one that didn't drop down there or rather that did drop down that we completely missed I think was Elton John and the Bitches Back that's uh, down and gone as with these old turntables sometimes more than one record used to drop down at once and uh, they were unpredictable like that, which is part of the fascination about them, because they were so unpredictable. You never know. And sometimes, even... Many times I've done this without filming, and three or four have dropped down at once. Uh, they do... The spindles kind of wear out a bit. This is... Uh, in fact, I think that one's starting to slip slightly. Yeah. So let's go on uh, to the last one, on Atlantic Records, from 19... 19- I think it is. Yeah, it's Chic and uh, My Forbidden Lover. I'm going to carry on doing stack 45s on a regular basis. Uh, singles from my archive from the 50s, the 60s, the 70s there's n- and the early 80s. There's no point in doing anything later than the early 80s because they will just slip because they don't have that locking sort of groove in the middle uh, just outside of the label. Uh, it's not actually a groove, it's a kind of uh, locking ridge. I'm going to turn that down uh, a little bit because I don't want uh, uh, this video to be pulled. Anyway, that's uh, Vinyl Cats. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do uh, hit the subscribe button. You're welcome to make comments, I'll uh, respond 
I'm trying to develop this channel in 2018. There's all kinds of other things happening on this channel. Lots of location footage as I go out buying records. And it's also an online journal and blog. Uh, I'm based in Sheffield in England in the United Kingdom. Uh, I'm a DJ. I'm a filmmaker. I'm a record collector. I'm uh, crazy into old technology as well. Anyway, until the next subsection of Vinyl Cats, which is stacked... 45s. Take care. To quote a certain fantastic legend of a DJ who is no longer with us, I'm afraid. Uh, greetings, pop pickers, and not off. This has been stacked 45 on Vinyl Cats. <laughs>